Are you trying to memorize everything on exam P and FM? You've got your distributions, your variance, your expectations, your durations, your geometric progressions, you've got your annuity factors and your summations and your MGFs, and you've just got so much stuff to memorize. Well, if you're trying to memorize it all, stop. Because you don't need to memorize it, and it's just wasting your time. I'm Bria, and in this video, I'm going to be telling you why you shouldn't be memorizing anything right now, and I'm going to tell you what you should be doing instead. Okay, here's why I don't recommend you start memorizing anything until your last week of studying. The number one reason is because when you're going through your study materials for the first time, there's a ton of stuff. And if you just start memorizing stuff as you go, well, you have no idea if you're actually going to use that stuff, so it can be a big waste of time. Instead, it's way, way, way better to actually wait, hold off on memorizing things until later because you'll be doing so many questions and during that time, that's when you're really going to get a good sense of what's important because the things that you have to do on all those questions will give you an idea of how different things are tested and all the different things that you'll need to actually know and memorize for the exam. Not only that, but it's really a bad idea to memorize in the first place because you want to actually be understanding the stuff that you're reading. It's not a good situation to be in if you've just memorized a whole bunch of formulas and don't know why they work because Sometimes you have to solve things from first principles, and if you've just memorized a whole bunch of formulas, it can be really difficult to solve some problems on the exam. But more importantly, I just don't want you to be spending so much time, wasting a lot of time, because I know you're busy. I don't want you to be wasting that time studying formulas and stuff that you don't need to know. Okay, so here's what I recommend you do instead. While you're going through your study material, make a formula sheet. A lot of the time you're given a formula sheet, but I think it's a lot more effective if you create your own study formula sheet. Um, because when you're writing it down yourself, that really helps you to embed it in your mind a bit. And during your last week of studying, that's when you're actually going to do your memorization. Now I've, so I've created another video before this with my three last minute exam P tips, something like that, I'll link to it. But in that video, I tell you why you should be studying right before bed, doing memorization during your like last 10 to 20 minutes before you go to sleep, because it's during that time, right before you go to bed, that your memories are going to be the most fresh in your mind. And those fresh memories are what is going to be best embedded into your mind while you sleep. So I really highly recommend that you do your memorization in the last week for the last 10 to 20 minutes before you go to sleep. And that will really help boost your likelihood of remembering those formulas on exam day. It's also a really good idea to actually write out formulas when you're memorizing them. I, I've just found from experience that I remember things so much better when I write it out rather than just looking at it. And one thing I've heard before is the best way to memorize anything is to say it, write it, and read it. So if you do all those three things, you're going to have a really good chance of memorizing. So if you've been memorizing formulas, I want you to stop. It's not a good idea because right now you don't know what the most important things are that you need to know. And through doing so many questions during your study period, I mean hundreds, 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 like I recommend doing seven to eight hundred questions while you're studying for exam and while you're doing all those you're going to learn what is actually important to memorize and what you'll need to memorize and then finally I recommend that during your last week that's when you do your hardcore memorization spend some time before bed and I think that will really help improve your studying efficiency if you like this video subscribe and give it a like I'll see you in the next one. Bye.